today I'm going to talk about a worse video game that actually exists on NES Deadly Towers and now I'm read to what the gameplay was about Ruba's Palace is presented in obliquey perspective. The nonlinear gameplay is comparable to that of The Legend of Zelda. And again, I think in my honest opinion, Opinion, even though I never played Deadly Towers on NES before, that kind of reminds me of a knockoff of Legend of Zelda. That just in my opinion. And I just want to let everyone know, again, a, a friendly reminder, if you type in Deadly Towers video game on IMDb. This game is a rating of 4 out of 10 stars. And again, the reason why it has that rating, it might have been a bad NES game back in the 80s, or I think it depending on how many copies were sold back then. And I'm pretty sure the graphics of this game was not perfect, but not great either. And I just want to let everyone know is if you enjoy playing worse in ES games, then I think this is the right game for you to play sometimes. Again, if you still have your NES system a long time, you go back in the 80s and 90s. And I just want to say is you're welcome to look for it at your local GameStop, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to be sold there and it's probably a really rare video game back in the mid 80s and a lot of people would probably may not know what is back then versus now and make sure to comment below what was your experience of playing Deadly Towers on NES before? And did you thought it was a bad video game? And again, just be honest of what you thought about it. And do I think this game is probably going to be garbage? Yeah. And that's all for my show today. And make sure to comment below. So don't forget to subscribe. Click like on the bottom below. Don't forget to hit the bell for more notifications. And that's all for my show today. And... See you next time.